Hi, in this video we'll be looking at how do we insert a table and also a figure using our insert caption uh, option in the references menu. We'll also look at how we add this to your table of contents. Now in part one of this series we looked at how we use adding styles to generate your table of contents. So you can look at that video uh, to be able to see how we did that. So the first thing that we want to do is we're going to use the results page and uh, here is where we're going to add the table. So I'm going to go to the results uh, page, that's page 4, and uh, we're going to go to the option for insert, that's insert menu, and we're going to go to table. And let's say we insert a two-dimensional table here. Uh, well, it's we're going to insert two columns and three rows and uh, we will have item and uh, let's make this quantity okay so we have item and quantity as or I'm just going to make this a normal text here let me see here normal okay good so we have item and quantity so this is our table and you could go ahead and you know manually name your table so I could say table 1 and this is showing items so this is my items table or I can use the automatic caption feature to add the caption to my table so I'm gonna go to the references section here or option menu the tab menu tab below menu and we have here the option for insert caption and this is found in the captions grouping I'm going to go to insert caption and by default is on figure one we can always change that using the label um, option here um, from figure to table and if you want to add a new label you can go to new label that is if it's not currently here inside the label option okay so I'm just going to go to table one and I'm going to type items here and then click on OK and you should notice it appearing above my table right here so I can just delete what I had manually entered there so table 1 here we go and uh, we want to add a figure to this section for results so I'm just going to go to the option for insert once again insert and I'm going to insert shapes so let's go to insert and shapes then I'm going to insert an oval shape which kind of looks like a chart in some way so yeah let's pretend this is a chart okay and so I can label this as let's say chart let's, let's say chart um, one or something okay let me change this caption to normal okay I uh, just went to the styles normal all right so this is chart one and let's call this chart showing let's say um, quantity so we have chart showing quantity here we go um, so we, we can add the caption for this as well just above the chart so I can just do this go back to my references option and then I'm gonna go to insert caption and this is not a table let's make it figure so we change that from um, table to figure and let's say chart showing quantity so we can click on OK here and there we go automatically we have our caption now so we have a caption for table one figure one so how do we get it on our table of content page is the question so we can go to the option once again for references we're in the caption section and then we go to the option for insert table of figures so this is where we'll go to get it on our table of content page so insert table of figures so we can go ahead and uh, we have the option here for inserting table of figures so we don't notice you have a tab leader here we don't need to have that so show page numbers and align page numbers right we don't need to have any leader there that's a dotted line so we can leave that blank 
and um, okay so we have everything that we need to to do here so we can go ahead and insert that's the table of figures and so I can just click on OK here and it inserts the figure one that we had there and I'm going to do the same for the chart as well okay so my chart is right here so I can just go ahead go back to insert table of figures don't want to have any leader here so I'll just click on none and um, you can see here it says caption label and in this case it's table that we're going to be using so I change that from uh, figure to table and click on OK now insert my table okay well let's do that again we want to have it in our table of content page so I have to go back up to the top let's go again so inside the content area go to insert um, table of figures change the caption label from figure to table and then click on OK and there we have it so this is how you would insert and this should have been before the results page this should have been here but this is how you'd actually insert um, your table of figures and also table of um, the list of tables and list of figures that you have to work with in your your document all right so i hope this video actually helped you and if it did then you can like it share it leave a comment and also subscribe thank you for watching